Hi guys, welcome back. Okay, so in this video, I want to talk about our header right here, and our header is static. This is our header. This area uh, that includes our menu as well. And by static, I mean it. It's going to be the same. I mean, we could have a ton of different pages right along here, and we are going to create new pages. All this content right here is going to change, but our header will always be the same. It's going to be the exact same. And right now, our our header is looking pretty bland. I uh, Generally, I like putting my social media icons right here when I build websites for people. And uh, obviously, I don't want to have this be the title of my website. So let's go to our back end of our WordPress. And let's click on Appearance. And let's look at Header right here. And immediately, I want to get rid of this. So I'm going to go ahead down here and click Remove Header Image. And let's go ahead and save the change. Let's go ahead and refresh it. It should say like Village Park right here. Just whatever we named our site. Village Park, just another WordPress site. But I don't want that to be my logo either. So what I'm going to do, <coughs> excuse me. I'm going to go to my website right here. And I'm going to go into Village Park University. Go to Introduction to HTML, XHTML. And if you scroll down a little bit, you should see a link that says Image File. What I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this image right here that I spent uh, 300 hours making. That was a joke. This image is horrible. I am probably the worst graphic designer in the history of the world. But for the sake of the video, this is just how you're going to upload your own logo. Once you guys have really good logos to represent your website or your company. So go ahead and drag this to your desktop. And now let's go back to our site right here. And if you want this image to come back, if you don't like how it just says Village Park right there, just go ahead and restore original header image, save changes. Now it's back. And let's go ahead and click browse right here. <clears throat> and we'll grab our JPEG that's on our desktop or wherever you had saved it. Let's go ahead and click upload. Uh-oh. Crop and publish. Okay, that should work. Those parts. Let's go ahead and refresh that. There it is. Obviously, I need to go back into Photoshop and check out what color drop this is and change it to what the color drop of this background is. But that's how we change our, uh, our header in WordPress. It's very simple. That's all we did. I mean, that's at least how we changed the header for this theme because every theme is a little bit different. And remember that we are on the responsive WordPress theme. We were on the stock WordPress theme called 2011 or 2010. But we went ahead and we uploaded this. And this is the theme that we're using. So what I'm going to do is, I don't know if I want to leave. I'll just leave this for the sake of the video. Just keep in mind that this doesn't look good. Um, again, I'm the worst graphic designer in the world, but that's just how we upload our, our, this is so bad. This is how we upload our, our logo or our branding to our WordPress theme. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video where we talk about putting social media icons right here.